Many of the most important people in my life are spread out all over the world. When I bought my house, I couldn't share the event with many of them in person, but using two free programs from Microsoft, Windows Live Photo Gallery and Photosynth, I was able to include them in the fun. Hi, I'm Brad Wright, a writer on the Windows team, and I'm going to show you a cool and interesting way to share your home using these two programs. Photo Gallery is a program I use to import, organize, edit, and share photos. Photosynth takes a collection of photos and makes a 3D map out of them that you can explore and share online. You can install these programs from the links on your screen. To get started, I'm going to need some photographs of the place I'm going to share. For the best results, take lots of photos of your subject from various angles and overlap each of the photos you take. Start wide and then move in close to capture fine detail. Also, avoid subjects that are one color, smooth, or shiny. They don't always synth well. For your first synth, start with a small collection of photos to see what works best. Once you get the hang of it, try creating a larger, more complex synth. I've already imported the photos I'm going to use into Windows Live Photo Gallery. Next, I'll select the photos I'll be using and click Extras, and then create a synth. This opens Photosynth with the photos I've selected in Photo Gallery. When Photosynth opens, I name my synth, tag it, and select the photos I want to upload. You can also set the visibility or who can see your finished synth. When I'm finished adding this information, I'll click Synth to upload and compile the photos into a Photosynth. Cool, now the Photosynth is complete. Let's take a look. To explore your completed synth, just click around. It's almost 3D. Photosynth has controls to navigate throughout a synth, zoom in and out, as well as sharing or embedding a link in a website or blog. Pretty cool, huh? Now my friends can check out my house without actually being there. Give Photosynth and Windows Live Photo Gallery a try and see what you can create.